Welcome everyone to the Cat's Meowth and a featured Friday video. Last week we looked at one of the first English promos, the Clefable pre-release. And this week we'll be looking at another English promo, the Nintendo World Pichu. And let's give this camera a minute to focus in. I had one of my subscribers recommend that I use the pack wrappers as a background rather than the mat. Hopefully get the lighting a little bit better. So if uh, you'd like to give me your opinion, I can go back to either one or we can try something new as well. So this card was first printed as a McDonald's promo in Japan and was then reprinted in the Emerald set in English. It never appeared in an actual Japanese set as there was never a Japanese Japanese equivalent of EX Emerald. The Emerald card set was released to coincide with the release of the Emerald video game. So they just combined a bunch of Japanese promos to make the English Emerald set. So Pichu is just a common in this set, and you can still see the common symbol right down there in the corner, but it's always been very popular thanks to the popularity of Pikachu. While I'm not sure if this card was ever playable, it's unlikely as it would be faster and use less space in the deck just to have a Pikachu Raichu line, it is set up to be playable. The Poke Power removes, re removes all damage when it evolves, and it has an attack that even draws. This particular promo, though, is stamped with Nintendo World May 2005 in the bottom left-hand corner of this picture. It was given out for a few weeks to celebrate the opening of a new Nintendo World in New York City. I don't know how many they were printed, but it's a high enough number that you can easily find this card without breaking the bank. They sell for around $10 on eBay right now, and even less on Troll and Toad, though Troll and Toad is currently sold out. I expect this card, though, to continue to rise in steady value, you know, no huge jumps, but uh, probably a dollar or so every year. So this may be a card for Pichu collectors to scoop up before it gets much higher. I hope everyone has enjoyed another Featured Friday video, and we'll stay tuned for next week. If you have any comments, concerns, uh, ways to improve this series. I would love to hear them in the comments below. Thanks everyone and stay tuned.